Hello, this is Pinkpoint. In this video, we will convert an octal number into a decimal number. Octal is a base 8 number system using 8 digits from 0 to 7, and we use a subscript 8 to identify an octal number. Whereas a decimal is a base 10 number system using 10 digits from 0 to 9, and we use a subscript 10 to identify a decimal number. For the conversion, we will start with 475 octal and convert it to decimal. The first step is to multiply 4, 7, and 5 to its positional value. Since this is octal, the first value from the right has a positional value of 8 raised to 0. The next is 8 raised to 1. Then this is 8 raised to 2. An increasing power of 8. The next, we are going to multiply 4 by 8 raised to 2. So this is 4 times 8 raised to 2 plus 7 times 8 raised to 1. 7 times 8 raised to 1 plus 5 multiplied by 8 raised to 0. So 5 times 8 raised to 0. Next is to simplify. 4 times 8 raised to 2 or 8 times 8 is equal to 64 plus 7 times 8 raised to 1 or 8 times 1 is equal to 8 plus 5 times 8 raised to 0 is equal to 1. Any number raised to 0 is equal to 1. Next is 4 times 64 is equal to 256 plus 7 times 8 is equal to 56 plus 5 times 1 is equal to 5. Then 256 plus 56 is equal to 312 plus 5. Then 312 plus 5 is equal to 317. So the decimal equivalent of 475 octa is 317. So this is 317. And for our second example, we are going to convert 1723 octal into decimal. So multiply 172. 2, 3 by its positional value. So this is 8 raised to 0. After 0 is 1, so 8 raised to 1. After 1 is 2, so 8 raised to 2. Then 8 raised to 3. The next is to multiply 1 by 8 raised to 3. So this is 1 times 8 raised to 3 plus 7 multiplied by 8 raised to 2. So 7 times 8 raised to 2 plus 2 multiplied by 8 raised to 1. So 2 times 8 raised to 1. Then 3 multiplied by 8 raised to 0. 3 times 8 raised to 0. Then simplify this one. 1 times 8 raised to 3 is equal to 5, 1, 2 plus 7 times 8. 8 raised to 2 is equal to 64 plus 2 times 8 raised to 1 is equal to 2 times 8 plus 3 times 8 raised to 0 is equal to 3 times 1. Then 1 times 512 is equal to 512 plus 7 times 64 is equal to 448 plus 2 times 8 is equal to 16 plus 3 times 1 is equal to 3. Then, 512 plus 448 is equal to 960, plus 16 plus 3 is equal to 19. So, 960 plus 19 is equal to 979. So, the decimal equivalent of 1723 octal is 979.
so this one is 9, 7, 9, base 10. For our third example, we will convert to 6, 0, 7, 1 octal into a decimal. Go ahead, pause the video, and try to answer this one. So for 2, 6, 0, 7, 1, we're going to multiply this to its positional value. So the first digit has a positional value of 8 raised to 0. Next is 8 raised to 1. After 1 is 2, so 8 raised to 2, 8 raised to 3, and 8 raised to 4. Next is to multiply 2 by 8 raised to 4. So 2 times 8 raised to 4 plus 6 multiplied by 8 raised to 3. 6 times 8 raised to 3 plus 0 multiplied by 8 raised to 2. 3rd times 8 raised to 2 plus 7 multiplied by 8 raised to 1. 7 times 8 raised to 1 plus 1 multiplied by 8 raised to 0. 1 times 8 raised to 0. Then next, 2 times 8 raised to 4 is equal to 4096 plus 6 times 8 raised to 3 is equal to 512 plus since this is 0, any number multiplied by 0 is equal to 0, so we can cancel this one. Okay, then move to 7 times 8 raised to 1. So 7 times 8 raised to 1 is equal to 8. Plus 1 times 8 raised to 0 is equal to 1 times 1. Any number raised to 0 is equal to 1. Then, 2 times 4096 is equal to 8192. Plus 6 times 512 is equal to 3072. Plus 7 times 8 is equal to 56. Then 1 times 1 is equal to 1. Then 8192 plus 3072 is equal to 11264. Plus 56 plus 1 is equal to 57. Then, 11264 plus 57 is equal to 11321. So, the decimal equivalent of 26071 octal is 11,321. So, this is 11,321. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe if you haven't yet and tap the notification bell to be notified every time I upload a new video.